everyone and their mama is posting. Y'all ain't ready for season two. Episode 14? <laughs> you have no clue what's about to happen. Yeah, no shit. It's my first time watching. Is it gonna be that crazy though? Don't let me down. This better be good. Let's begin today's reaction. Yeah, the acting was great. Oshinoku-esque. Oh, Kaede. Oh, she might finally do something. Alright, alright. So today's episode is Kaede focused. This girl hasn't done shit in season one. It hangs around the most important character, Nagisa. She showed up to make pudding once and then fucked off. Now she's back. This is the moment. Harasumide. Secret identity time. Secret identity by who? Okay, she fucked up. Koro-sensei so perceptive. <laughs> Kill him. Then it would have already happened. Oh, yeah. Got pretty close. I would argue that Nagisa, the suicide tactic from Terasaka, like we four sensei is like one month jail, get out of jail free card, the molting. That's quite significant. Ituna fraud. Three rounds, bro. <laughs> Another treasure, that's right. Okajima's treasure. Okay. Secret identity, she says. Not even your closest friends got to hear True Blade. The episode intro stuff was secret identity or something. Is Kaede been absent because she's secretly Batman? Like, she's like. A, like a paid actor, some sort of like secret assassin that's been planted from the fucking beginning, just waiting and waiting and waiting, and now her true identity will come out. What is this? What do you mean? What do you fucking mean, bro? What? Who are you? What are you really? Oh. This is some Koro sensation. This is some Koro sensation. What? This is not human. It's a tentacle -esque. No one knows. No one knows. No one knows. Never. Yeah, because you didn't do shit. You were AFK all of season one. In season 2, you made a pudding and fucked off! How was I supposed to know? Why now, though? Why now, though? She was ready. Koro-sensei's sister? Are the eye colors similar to Itona? I'm not sure, but if... Is technically, like, Itona, Kaede, and now Koro-sensei all family because of the same experimentation, kind of? Mm. So like the reason why she's been waiting all this time is because she was observing. Yeah, the reason why she literally was AFK until now, she's just taking notes. What is the best tactic? The Reaper's tactic worked pretty well. Oh. That's pretty good. That's right, the beam attack. Kurosensei's Kamehameha. 
That was close. Damn, Nagisa got messed up too. All right. Long hair Kaede, man. The secret is out. Just like Nagisa, she was tying her hair up. No. This is cooler Kayano. The secret's out now. Hey, what are you? <gasps> the fuck is Yukimura Aguri? Yukimura, is that the girl? Is that the girl? Is that the woman? Is it the woman in the research lab? I murdered her? Who? Hara, who is it? Secret entity. Are you coming to class? Tentacle the tentacle. Oh. Damn, this really is the cooler fucking Kaede, bro. This is so funny. Where like... You know like um, dweeb looking characters? Like, perfect example is like um, Aizen or that guy from Iruma-kun. Where their hairstyle is just like all nerdy and shit. And then, you know, the moment comes for it to be evil. And they're like... <laughs> and then the fucking bang comes down, right? This is the cooler Kaede. It's the same thing. Button down. <laughs> Button down Kaede, bro. Hair down. Yukimura. Who the hell is that, bro? Itona. You got a sister, maybe. She was sweating a bit on her face. No, no, no. There was a moment. I remember for sure. She's sweating here too. She's sweating here too, right? She's sweating here too. Poker face. There is like, you know, effects of this happening. But uh, I don't know. How long is she gonna last? Maybe she's just the perfect product. Better than Ituna. Old teacher? Who? Maseharuna. Acting. So the, the whole Kaide, we got Oshino code. It was all an act, bro. The pudding stuff? I can do whatever if I put my mind to it. <laughs> all just a fucking facade. We never knew her. But then again, it doesn't matter. Because I don't know her. She AFK'd for all of season one. Okay. For Nagisa, this is probably crazy because, you know, Nagisa was so close to Kaide. No, Shiro. I always get them mixed up. Okay. Already she had it? When did that happen? So like, they did experiment on her. She's not just some natural born person like that. The way he's talking makes it pretty ambiguous. I confirm she harbored tentacles of her own. When did that happen? Like, it doesn't sound like you brought into a lab and did shit with Ituna. I don't know. Maybe this is that Yukimura person. Maybe it really is the, uh, the scientist person that Koro-sensei was you know, talking to in the flashback. And this is her sister and then experimentation. Separate stuff going on from Shiro's group? I don't know. Poker face for an entire season and a half of season two. Okay. Now she's so cool. She better not be a disappointment. New drip? Sister. As my agency. Extended leave from acting, the whole, you know, acting career. Yep, yep. That must have been the sh shitty thing that happened. Okay, so now this relates exactly to that flashback where the girl is dying and tells Koro-sensei, please save Clan 3E, right? 
Give me the lore. Give me the lore. I think this is it. And if we continue with the theory that this woman here, that who is Kaede's sister now, is, you know, the principal Asano's wife, then Kaede is the principal's daughter-in-law? Right? I mean, just a, just, just a, just a theory right now that we've been building up, but what, huh? No! I'm retarded. It's sister-in-law. It's 5.12 in the morning, okay? It's 5.12 a.m. And we're, we've been streaming for 8 hours and 20 minutes, okay? My brain is not there. How is the re-zero reaction gonna go? I have no clue. My brain is not here, okay? We're in the twilight zone. Running on fumes. Just adrenaline and second tank, okay? Things are gonna get fucking unhinged. <gasps> Koro sensei! I bet he tried to save her. There's no way he killed her. And then he left after being instructed, go save 3E. <laughs> Wonder how this building all collapsed. Homeroom teacher. Let's read that shit again. To whom may concern, I will withdraw for now, but I am willing to take over as homeroom teacher. Kunigaku, a junior high class 3E. I will visit at a later date to negotiate. Signed, a super destructive being. Koro sensei. I will withdraw for now. Withdraw. Interesting wording. The building also just collapsed. Koro Sensei didn't cause it. But like, I could see a situation where Koro Sensei was in like an incubation chamber, some sort of pod, and like some mistake happened. And due to the uh, early like awakening of Koro Sensei or the, you know, the alien project, the building all just collapsed and exploded. Like, it looks very odd that the entire building just boom, collapsed all together. Maybe someone set this shit up. Someone set this up. Who could have set this up? People who know what's happening in the building and are against this project. Why did this project even get created? People say that Koro Sensei wanted to be a hero. Right? I think Asano Principal mentioned that. He used to be a human and all he wanted to be was a hero. But something bad happened. Maybe this also has to do with like a rival faction of people who also employs the same like research. Like think about it. Shiro and them. It doesn't look like, I don't know, like Shiro and them? And then there's like this side. And maybe there's competition and trying to backstab each other. Oh no. Tentacle cells. From where? From what? Cthulhu? Then she took it and that's how she transformed. You're worried getting these tentacle cells? Asus. ASUS. ASUS, you know, fucking ad right there. Is it ASUS actually? It's sus to me. Sussy. ASUSY. ASUS. Tentacle. So, like, Koro Sensei doesn't feel pain at all? He's a perfect experiment? What about maintenance? That literally said it. Provides great power, but at the cost of hellish pain if maintenance is neglected. How is maintenance done? I don't know. Has Koro Sensei just been enduring the entire time? What the hell is that? Yeah, he is pretty much all. Like Itona, you know, and you know, her. They're very human like. Koro Sensei is just a fucking just a blob. He's a taco. Oh. Hair color still didn't change yet. Voice changed. To be washed. Okay. Oshinoko arc. Put me in there. <laughs> she just pulled up after acing everything. And then pulled out this thing and says, Send me to 3E. Do it. Okay. That's right. That was the wish she told to Kuro-sensei. 
Those jeans? What? Forever flat? Dude, the forever flat memes now, holy shit. Like, it's not even... I mean, ah, oh, fuck. It, we, we, gotta stay, we gotta stay locked in. We gotta stay locked in. B clip my ass. Hmm, I shall change that too. Green. To represent. That's crazy. You're just gonna implant that shit? You just bear the endurance. Sorry, the pain. Damn. Season plus a half a season of just acting. Wow. Super early. Super early, Nagisa, with ponytail. Rudy is gray rat looking hair. あ、短くしたいけど、目立っても目立たなくても警戒されるだから配役を工夫しなきゃ。私はその脇役に徹するんだ。オッケー。あ、ほら。あ、ほら。あ、ほら。あ、ほら。あ、ほら。あ、ほ
And until we get Kayuna back, I will not answer. All right. <laughs> Hills, come to the field of zebra glass in the hills behind the school of 7 p.m. tonight. It's zebra grass, okay? It'd be funny if the subject said death. Because the subject says none over here. But imagine the title was death. She's still sweating everywhere. Hmm? <gasps> she is the one that named Koro Sensei. Unkillable Sensei. Koro Sensei. Oh shit. Mama. So. She is Koro Sensei's mom. But she's also a sister in law. Of Asano principal, maybe. And she is the sister of Big Sister. And Shiro is also Big Brother of Kaede, who is a mama to Koro Sensei. Therefore, Shiro is. Unk? <laughs> I don't fucking know you. I'm going. My brain. <laughs> Great unk? I don't know. I don't know. Fuck, fuck, fuck that shit. Father in law? Is it father in law? Big. You're trolling me. No, father in law. No, wait. No, it's a cut. It's unk. It's unk. <laughs> my brain. Please, my brain. <laughs> and Itona is also brother of Koro Sensei? So she has. Two kids. <laughs> what is happening? What is happening? <laughs> oh, shit. Okay. There's also Asano, by the way. There's also Principal Sun, by the way. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Since when were you under the impression that I was Kayana Kaide? She never existed, fool. Yep. Just a lie. I never liked any one of you, stinky motherfuckers. Ah, she ri- Oh. That's right, she did get brutal. There's so many moments where she truly just held back so much. This is the biggest long con, man. She truly just waited for the end game. Yeah. And she used to be homeroom teacher at 3E? And here's the thing. Why would the principal... If she is the wife, send his own beloved wife to teach at end class when he doesn't give a fuck about end class. What's up with that? Maybe there's like a difference in like ideology. Maybe they're divorced. That'd be the most awkward fucking relationship. What is that? Paradise? Bro, it's called the end class. We're ending here. He's very cute. Funny. Ah, uh, her shirt. Big guy, middle guy, small guy. Middle guy is more colored, and there's an arrow on it, like a player character. We're choosing the middle guy. Kind of looks like an octopus, not really, just the head. <laughs> what is that teacher supposed to represent? Two weeks. Just two weeks. Come on, you know him. He would never do that. Talk it out. Her arms are shaking. She's sweating. Hesitation. She lying. She doesn't want to fight. Yeah. And like that's a fundamental difference between people with implanted tentacles versus people 
who are just all tentacle like Koro Sensei. Fire! Koro Sensei, can you do that? Okay. How's she doing this? Okay, her body's getting hot. It's are you really? She's in the zone. <laughs> Nagisa was like, wait, no, don't do this. If you kill someone, dude, sacrifice yourself. You won't be yourself. Don't worry. I know. I'm not going to sacrifice myself. I'm just going to kill him. Okay. Alright, go ahead. Pretty strong. I feel like she's kind of lying to herself. Damn, she got a tentacle. She's gonna go crazy. This isn't gonna be good. Yeah, your head doesn't hurt anymore because you're probably gonna die. Like, look, it's over. You're just being drained. Koro-sensei, you better stop this. Ah, that face makes it look like she wants to say save me rather than die. Save me. Kill me. There it is, there it is. Whatever. I got to help me at the end, even though I missed with the family tree stuff. I got family tree stuff is confusing to me sometimes. It makes my fucking head hurt. Plus, remember, we're reaching nine hours of the stream. It is now 5.34 a.m. in the morning. That's today's episode of Assassination Classroom. And goddamn, you're all right. Episode 14 was fucking crazy. In terms of like bombshells, in terms of like crazy lore, like, yeah, yeah. Asano Principal showing up and explaining his past. That was pretty crazy revelations. But this, this is, I think, way more significant. This is crazy. There is a plot-related reason why Kaide was AFK for a season and a half. And it's not because she's some random NPC that gets forgotten. No, she was biding her time, observing, carefully, just hiding behind Nagisa's presence, propping him to be the MC. She's in the shadows to plot her revenge. Why? Because she's an Avenger. It's really sad because Koro-sensei did not kill her, the sister. And even if she indirectly did, it's not Koro-sensei's fault. There's no way he could have done that. Maybe he did, maybe he was in sort of berserk state. But it's all about the intent, and I don't think Koro-sensei would ever do that. Now, if Shiro did something, that would be so sad because, you know, Shiro and her, they're kind of like working together right now. And it'd be just, just like, damn, you're really helping out the dude that could have been behind your sister's death. Yet, you're gonna kill Koro-sensei who took Hiro her dying wish to teach this class. Crazy shit. Is it too late to save Kaede? I'm not sure. I am not sure if like uh, Koro-sensei sorry, can save Kaede. But like, it would feel fucked up if we uh, just killed Kaede. So, fingers crossed. That's it for me. If you're still here, if you enjoyed this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for even more content. And until next time, take care.